The Goodyear FIA European Truck Racing Championship was all sunshine and smiles as we headed to Zolder for the sixth race meeting of our 2023 campaign and with another packed crowd out to see our racing trucks and our drivers, everybody was in very high spirits. It was lovely to see some sunshine at Zolder as well after our last few visits had certainly been filled with rain, so I know that the drivers and teams were all very welcoming of the hot weather. Norbert Kish was certainly welcoming of it, taking pole position once again in race one as he led away Jochen Hahn, Sasha Lenz and the excellent Jose Eduardo Rodriguez who was having a real fine form weekend so far. After a couple of laps though, Norby was slowing and then down the start finish straight, a colossal turbocharger failure ended his race in dramatic fashion. Luckily though, with some quick thinking, he was able to get behind the barriers at the end of the pit lane and get back into the paddock for repairs as soon as possible. All you had to do was follow the smoke cloud. While our pitches are very dramatic, there was no major fire or incident and Norby was perfectly fine, but the team had some serious work to do to get that turbocharger replaced before the second race of the day. But this was the Reves Racing Team. Of course, they had it under control and they had Norby back out for the second race. Meanwhile on the circuit, Jochen Hahn took the race victory from Sasha Lenz with the awesome Jose Eduardo Rodriguez getting his first race one podium of the year. Race two would start with the two Scaniers on the front row, Heinrich Clementecker and Stefan Fass. Stefan would go off in the first couple of corners and lose his lead, and then Heinrich Clemens Hecker would throw it away as well, giving the lead to Antonio Albacetti. He would then end up in the gravel later on at Turn 3 with Sasha Lenz after this dramatic shunt. Antonio continued to lead while Norbert Kish carved his way through the order as usual. Stefan Fass unfortunately would red flag the race, ending up in the wall just before Norby took the lead from Antonio, so the win went to Albacetti, but then back to Norby after penalties were applied later in the evening. Sunday came around with more sunshine for us and Norbert Kish would romp away at the front of the pack despite some amazing battles earlier on in the race, and he would eventually take his second race win of the weekend ahead of Sasha Lenz, Jochen Hahn and Antonio Albacetti. Race three was red flagged though due to this spectacular failure for Louis Requenco, Luckily though, the fire went out all on its own and Louis was perfectly fine, but that would end the racing action as far as his weekend was concerned. Another red flag stoppage was not what we wanted to see, but still, as long as Louis was okay, that was the main thing. After this, Norbert Kish would then go on to take another race victory in the fourth and final race of the day, and as mentioned, it was all sunshine and smiles to complete the weekend on the top step for Norby. He now has 305 points in the championship with a great lead heading towards Le Mans.